Whether you're trying to prevent diabetes, reduce belly fat, or improve your energy levels, understanding insulin resistance could be the key to unlocking better health. Today, we're going to break down a critical topic, insulin resistance. So, what exactly is insulin resistance? Insulin is a hormone that's made in your pancreas, and its primary role is to manage your blood sugar levels. After you eat, especially if you've had carbs or sugar, your blood sugar rises. Insulin helps move that sugar from your bloodstream into your cells, where it's used for energy. When you consistently eat too many carbs or sugary foods over time, your body produces more and more insulin to handle the excess sugar. Eventually, your cells become resistant to insulin signal. It's like trying to unlock a door with a key that's starting to wear down, it just doesn't work as well anymore. Now, why should you care about insulin resistance? Well, insulin resistance isn't just about diabetes. It can lead to all sorts of health problems, including, increased belly fat, that stubborn weight around your waist. High blood pressure, making it harder for your heart to pump blood efficiently. High cholesterol and triglycerides, which can clog your arteries and lead to heart disease. Inflammation, the root of many chronic diseases, from joint pain to cancer. Type 2 diabetes, the most common long-term consequence of untreated insulin resistance. The tricky part is that insulin resistance develops slowly, often without any obvious symptoms at first. By the time people start noticing weight gain or fatigue, it's usually been building up for years. But here's the good news, you can reverse it naturally. Let's talk about what causes insulin resistance. While genetics play a role, lifestyle factors are the biggest culprits. The most common causes include eating too many processed carbs and sugary foods, think white bread, pastries, sugary drinks, and even hidden sugars in foods like sauces and snacks. A sedentary lifestyle, sitting for long periods without moving reduces your body's ability to manage insulin effectively. Chronic stress, high stress leads to increased cortisol, which raises blood sugar levels, forcing your body to produce even more insulin. Poor sleep, not getting enough sleep or having poor quality sleep can mess with your body's insulin response, making it harder to manage blood sugar levels. If these factors sound familiar, don't worry. While insulin resistance can have serious consequences, there are simple, effective ways to reverse it. Here's the part you've been waiting for, how to reverse insulin resistance. And no, it doesn't have to be complicated. Here are some scientifically proven strategies you can start today. Cut down on processed carbs and sugar, switch to whole foods like vegetables, lean proteins, and healthy fats. Foods rich in fiber, such as leafy greens and legumes, can help slow the absorption of sugar into your bloodstream, reducing the need for insulin. Get moving, exercise is one of the best ways to make your cells more sensitive to insulin. Even 30 minutes of walking a day can make a huge difference. Reduce stress, mindfulness practices like meditation, yoga, and deep breathing can lower cortisol levels and, in turn, reduce insulin resistance. Improve your sleep, prioritize getting 7-8 to eight hours of quality sleep each night. Studies show that poor sleep can make your cells more resistant to insulin, so good rest is crucial these small changes can have a big impact. Reversing insulin resistance can help you lose weight, improve your energy levels, and even lower your risk of heart disease and diabetes. Insulin resistance doesn't have to control your life. With the right information and a few lifestyle changes, you can take control of your health and age gracefully. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and tap the notification bell to stay updated with our latest tips for living a healthier life as you age. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Disclaimer this video is for educational purposes only and is not intended to replace medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare professional before making significant changes to your diet or exercise routine.